Hey, your clock's here. Your clock's here. Okay, we'll do an extra one <laughs> for this week. Uh, so, Andrew, I hate mail, homosexual, I'm an atheist, hate mail. Basically, you actually do a bunch of screen caps on YouTube, DeviantArt, of comments that I made, there is lots of comments that I made against the Deviant Lifestyles, and a few other things. Trigger warning, we have someone who is getting this stuff totally wrong, the Bible stuff totally wrong, totally just, I mean, a lot of you know, issues here, and basically I am uh, checking, on, you know, reading the Bible. Mm, I have my, my phone, my gas, my gas phone, with um, Bible verses in it. Mm. I was just looking them up and uh, checking them against this stuff. And of course, this, the other Bible says that this person's wrong. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're showing that off. Let's continue on here. Uh, what was it? Or actually, not what you think. It's when God's true people shine with the glory of God and are actually healed. No, bullcrap. Mm. No, it's when uh, this, it says here Malachi, read Malachi, Mal, Malachi 4. Two through four, and that is four through two four. But uh, for you who hear my name, Christians, the sun, uh, S U N, of righteousness will rise with healing in its rays, and you will go out and frolic like well fed calves. Then you will trample the wicked, they will ask you to your soldiers your feet on the day when I ask, says the Lord God, says the Lord God Almighty. Okay, that's four. Well, and four, remember the law of my servant Moses, the decrees and laws that gave him at horror for all Israel. Okay, so basically, the rapture will involve everyone, all Christians. Be caught away with Jesus. Okay, the dead of Christ will rise and be caught away. Go to heaven, uh, Lord. Yeah, join Jesus. Uh, those who are alive in Christ will be caught away as well, and then the judgment will happen. You know, judgment is going to happen. Things like that, tribulation, things like that. Yeah, yes, there'll be healing. Well, our bodies will be made perfect. Things like that. But it's not. That's not all there is. It's not just that. It's, it's everything else. You know. You know, stuff like that. It's not all. This is this person getting it wrong. You know, it's bad teaching. This is what it is. And go next. By the way, anything based on gender? No, okay, what is, uh, what is oh yeah, yeah. A uh, person says Donald Trump is of the Antichrist. Is of the Antichrist spirit. He will die with the wicked. If he chooses not to repent. Um, I don't know if he's Antichrist. Uh, yeah, he, he's messing around doing wicked things. So if he does not choose to repent, he will die. Mm, so that's correct. Mm. That's right. Uh, Malachi 2 provides, Mal provides Malachi 1, 3, and 8. And 11 is talking to thieving church leaders. Wait, mm, Malachi 2? Mm. Trample on the wicked? Mm. Wait. Uh, 3. Malachi 3. Malachi 3. Malachi 3, 8, and 11. Five, six, seven, eight. Will a mere mortal rob God? Mm -hmm. Eight and eleven? Eight, three, eight through eleven. Yet you rob me, but you ask, how are we robbing you? In tithes and offerings? <clears throat> this is coming from the person who said that monetary tithing is a lie. <laughs> it ain't a lie. Mm -hmm. You know, this, by saying monetary tithing is wrong, mm -hmm. okay? You're basically selling people to rob God. <laughs> you gotta stop. <laughs> oh my gosh. In tithes and offerings, you are under a curse or only because you are robbing me. Bring the whole tithe into the storehouse that there may be food in my house. Test me in this, says the Lord God Almighty, and see if I will not throw open the floodgates of heaven and pour out such blessing there will not be room enough to store it. We just learned about this in, in church, in our new church place we're going to. You know, so I'm sorry. Would you be messing around saying you know, tithing wrong? But Bible say tithing right. I'm going to believe the Bible. Thank you. Get you on here. Uh, every single fake preacher, if they know they brought the money back what they were supposed to take from ministering, then God will later COVID it. Another problem. Mm, again, again, think about how this person tries to relate this stuff to uh, current events. Mm, mm, they, God would end COVID, but they love money so much they intentionally choose to kill everyone instead of repenting. I'm like, oh. <laughs> they uh, say COVID is a thing. Mm, it's basically a punishment from God because people are tithing and you know, there's church corruption in the church. I, I don't agree. I don't agree with that. Mm -hmm. You know, there is issues with corruption in the church. Mm -hmm. We need to work on that, but not because of uh, you know, mm -hmm. it's not causing COVID. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the devil calls it mm -hmm. so as an attack. Mm -hmm. well, that's another yet another one. Mm -hmm. You know, you fight against it. Next, uh, I say, wow, I've never seen anyone get the scripture so wrong. <laughs> you know, jeez, the Bible's uh, mm -hmm. so wrong. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, it's the one that's, oh, yeah. Yeah, this is good. The person says, uh, I am literally Elijah of Malachi 4, 5, and 6. No, you're not. Mm -hmm. Any discrepancies are decided to our, our eight just, you know, decided by me. Nope, they're not. Now, you just chose to die with a wicked by saying that I'm wrong according to the Bible. And, you know, because you study the Bible. <laughs> you know, I, I'm saying, oh, no, no, I'm right. Mm -hmm. That's it. Uh, please repent before it's today for you. Mm -hmm. Nope. I did my job you know, to warn you. Now it's, it's your choice. I say, you're so confused. See, the ones you call wicked are actually righteous. And the ones you call righteous are actually wicked. And homosexual acts are forbidden in the Bible. You know? And, oh, someone says, how else says, oh, okay, well, how you have fun with that. That seems like awful, like the most prestigious and awful way to live. Only seeing everything through the lens of your beliefs of truth. You know? Describing everyone else's ideals and practices because your scriptures are scribbles are right mm, and theirs aren't. Mm, theirs isn't. Mm, yeah. mm, 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 that's the way it goes. The only difference between you and the person in the release, uh, you and that person and their beliefs that you're claiming which is wrong are the matter of bringing matter of chance and matter of truth. Mm, sorry. I'd like to thank that every unfortunate soul in the world that had a hard warped upbringing is simply being condemned for their past actions for a previous life, so to speak. Uh, Booker. Uh, so that's ridiculous. Life doesn't work that way. It would be too cruel to think that, think this way, even in the event that there were really nothing after death. There's really nothing after death. And to look down upon people who weren't dealt the same cards. And it also your channel is a perfect example of how bad your opinion is. It's dead. Well, not really dead. Mm, it's actually more alive than it's ever been. Mm, hi, guys. Mm, yeah. Maybe be more open minded and it will grow mm, in ways I like. Mm, you know, yeah, you know, start kissing. Mm, start kissing stuff. Mm, kneeling down and kissing things. Please. Mm, like, no. Mm, nope. Mm, go. I say it's not dead, it's small. It may not be growing as fast as the channel that likes everyone's boots, but it's grow it is growing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Next. Someone says there are a lot of trans people who are confused. There are a lot of people who are not trans who are confused. No, that's true. Mm -hmm. But yeah, mm -hmm. some people are confused. What would you do if someone called again Christian a lifestyle? Mm -hmm. Be like that's normal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're right. You know that it isn't. It actually is. Mm -hmm. It's a lifestyle, mm -hmm. way of living. Mm -hmm. You know. You can't prove that. Yeah, I can. Mm, it's a lifestyle. It's bad. It's good. Mm, Christianity is a lifestyle, and it's a very important lifestyle to follow. Mm, follow the ways of God. Mm. Uh, it's one of the saddest things I ever heard of. These people basically saying it's not a lifestyle. It's just the way we're, 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 we're living life. <laughs> I'm like, uh, you know, what is this thing? This is uh, some sort of neighborhood chronicle. It's called newspaper for veterans, all and all who love them. Mm -mm. November, December, 2022. Mm. A while ago, mm, yeah, but makes a good fan, mm, yes, it does. All right, next, uh, yeah, and of course, I like the veterans too. Mm, my mom's a veteran, so yeah, mm, my dad's a veteran, so yeah, mm, there you go. Very important. Uh, what's this? You know, somebody can't prove that you know they're being Christians about being in a relationship with Jesus, uh, and following him throughout your life. Mm, that's the lifestyle. Mm. But someone might look at you and say, Be Christian is about doing this and not doing that. It, it is. <laughs> well, depending on what this and that are. <laughs> you know, nothing you would say to them would change their minds. That's how it is with someone who's trans and someone says, well, like you, says, We're just living a lifestyle. But no, it, it is a lifestyle. <laughs> you, know? you know, it's like, yeah, basically you say, Oh, I learned this. <laughs> you know, so I started changing how I do things in life. <laughs> you know, and now I'm living this way. It's a lifestyle. <laughs> Jeez. Subject to be discussed intelligently beyond the sensational crap that makes all the headlines. Beyond the Matt Walsh caricature. Mm, who cares? Uh, but most people on both sides are up to it. If you have to clean your room, young man, smiley face, I'm like, oh, that's my bedroll. <laughs> I have a bed now. <laughs> you know, that's the most I respect to understand your opinion. However, <laughs> 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 oh, sorry. Okay. However, I believe people should keep that same energy and smile with this. Real, one of the same people who successfully overturned Roe v. Wade, decided to successfully overturn Loving versus Virginia, Overfell versus Hodges, or civil rights that is through the protection of women and other vast minorities, like they're trying to do right now, and tell me that they're actually pro, they are actually if they are actually pro life. In other words, how would you feel if your rights were stripped away tomorrow? Uh, abortion was never a right. Mm, you were fooled by marketing. Mm, you people keep saying that abortions have a lot of dangerous risks. They do, uh, but so do guns without reform laws. Yet they're not worried about the dangerous risk of that. Everything in the world is its risk and pros and cons, but abortion involves killing babies, so uh, shouldn't be doing that. Next, not just abortions. God told us that uh, those who have been up to a sin do not have the right to cast stones upon others. No matter how great or small a sin is, a sinner is a sinner. That's true. Who am I to take their lives like I created them or something? Um, a person. <laughs> Maybe people believe that women are responsible for their own babies. But the government is also responsible for. Uh, but if the government falls, fails to support women, our families they be quick to blame the parents, even though they force that woman and child, that force that woman and child. Oh wait, I'm sorry, God. Oh, sorry. 
force that woman and child to be in that position of, you know, the child being able to live. <laughs> woman having to uh, change her life to accommodate that child. And that's, uh, yeah, kind of a problem. When in reality, the government cannot handle self responsibility for their own people themselves. The most ironic part is, is that these people who run the government are claimed to be pro life, will only seek abortions if they're younger, is it children, or, or 